Well, good evening there folks. <clears throat> Thanks for joining me um, in the workshop this evening, burning the, the midnight oil, so to speak. Um, it's making this lovely uh, George Jensen, um, uh, George Jensen Goodwill. Um, I can't remember the shape, I think it's 440. I don't know if the camera's picking this up in this light. Yeah, I've managed to borrow a camera because um, I've got lots of estate pipes um, I'm polishing up and uh, restoring a bit and so um, I thought having a good camera could uh, be um, important at this stage. I'm going to be smoking some Capstan Blue, just uh, straight Virginia, <coughs> quite, uh, yeah, quite nice. Um, I prefer it to the Capstan Yellow, uh, the Capstan Yellow is a bit more mellow, this, this for me is a bit, um, a bit more depth, a bit more fruitiness. Yeah, no, no, no discernible topping. Nice flakes. Yeah, it's just a great, um, great all round. Uh, just, just pure Virginia. I, I like it. Uncomplicated. Flakes burn for quite a long time, so um, it's good for working. And this, this is a great shape pipe for working. Actually, I can um, fix it. Sit there quite naturally. <clears throat> yeah. Anyway, what have we been doing in the workshop? Well, um, yeah, maybe uh, I'll show you. And voila, pipes are plenty. A little cheap um, polishing wheel. Um, yeah, some uh, micro mesh pads. They're brilliant. I think the pink one goes up to 12,000 grit, so you can, you can really get a shine on the old um, vulcanite stems. Um, pipe cleaners. We have a tab of um, alcohol because I uh, reuse my pipe cleaners. I put them into the into the ethanol, soak them, give them a... I'm sorry, you don't, don't like waste. Uh, current projects. Lots of stems to uh, polish up. And it's just... this really satisfying when you go from something like that to uh, you know kind of something like that at the moment we're just trying to uh, do a super glue black super glue repair on this vulcanite stem that uh, goes onto this um, African meerschaum with a nice pipe Nice church warden, big bowl actually for a church warden. Uh, an unsmoked Shackham Nature. Uh, these are ones that are getting polished, well, pretty much done. They're nice, uh, quite rare, I think. This one, the Savonelli Punto Ori with the 9925, I think it is, a uh, silver band. This is one of my favourites. It's uh, Somme of Paris. And I think this is quite old. Conservatively, it's the 80s, but it could be way, 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 way older than that. Yeah, it was a bit of a sorry state when we got it. A lovely sand. Lovely sand blast. Yeah, a few other nice ones in there. Little um, crown. There's a little pipe. Stanwell. But yeah, it's all... Uh, into the reamer there. Yeah, that's well. That's that's kind of the workshop. But the um, percarbonate de sud, so it's sodium percarbonate. It's um, it's kind of uh, what um, I think what they refer to in the states is is it ever bright or something like this. It's um, it's basically bicarbonate of soda and hydrogen peroxide, and when it's mixed with warm water, it um, takes all the oxidization of the of the um, of the uh, vulcanite stems makes it easier to polish. How oh, talking of stems, yeah, this is lovely, lovely Cumberland stem on this one. But yeah, this uh, been keeping me busy. It's snowed outside, so uh, into um, Corona snow lockdown. <laughs> I love um, <clears throat> restoring these old briars. It, 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 they unravel for me 
especially when you get them onto the wheel and you're sanding and you get really familiar with the contours and um, they just uh, I do cast cast my cast my mind back to the uh, original makers the polishers and the factory they the previous owner what kind of person were they like um, for example this is all about a man so yeah Talking of these matters, I'm not going to clutter up my um, YouTube channel uh, with lots of estate pipes um, because I'm uh, just opening, well, I have just opened an Etsy shop, so I'm going to put them onto Etsy and uh, keep this uh, channel uh, without uh, commercialization because I think uh, otherwise, kind of, in some ways, flies in the face of the uh, gentlemanly um, um, unwritten protocols of the uh, YTPC, in my opinion. I think it's good to keep it a commercial free um, zone. Um, but what I will do, I've um, opened up um, an Instagram and so if you just want to look at some nice pictures of these pipes um, yeah, I've taken quite a, a few nice ones so far of the camera. Um, so if yeah, take a look at the pictures and uh, yeah, leave a comment, and uh, that that would be great to get to get some um, followers over there. And I'll leave a link to my Etsy shop. And if anybody wants to look, they're welcome. But you know, that's um, that's as far as it goes on the uh, on the um, <laughs> ungentlemanly topics of um, money and commerce. Well, hopefully I'll get back to you and, um, shortly. The weather's been absolutely too horrible to go outside. There was a bit of a white morning and it was nice and snowy and then it just turned into mushy rain and um, so not uh, not very not very photo photogenic out there at the moment. But um, yeah, I will endeavour to uh, make the most of this camera I've borrowed and uh, bring some better quality um, videos of uh, yeah you know out and about in my neighbourhood in the forests and. Uh, Things like that. We shall see. We shall see. I keep hearing um talking of nature down in the uh, in front of me. There's a big valley that goes down to a river, way way down in the bottom of the valley, and there's a uh, there's there's big male deer um stags rutting down there at the moment, and uh, if if you've never heard it before, it, it it sounds like dinosaurs in the forest in the depths of night. It's pitch black, and you can hear just hear these these groans and roars from these. Uh, I guess um, horny um, stags in the forest. <laughs> so uh, yeah, <laughs> that's uh, quite exciting. <laughs> anyway, I'll leave you to it. Thanks. Um, have a nice pipe. Have a good evening, and um, see you again soon. Thanks for watching, and uh, yeah, take care, everybody. <laughs>